Developing right now at noon, a South Florida rapper Kodak Black appearing in court today. It comes after an arrest warrant was issued over the weekend for him in Broward County. Local 10 News reporter Roy Ramos joins us live from Fort Lauderdale. He tells us what happened when that rapper went before a judge today. Well, Kodak back very outspoken in court today saying this was all a mix-up. Well, the judge gave him an opportunity to try and clear up that mix-up by providing a hair sample to conduct a drug test. Well, he refused, rather, choosing to check into a rehab facility instead. Can, can we talk to you about the judge's ruling today? No, no. thank you so much, sir. No comment from South Florida rapper Kodak Black as he walked out of a Broward County courtroom with his attorney Bradford Cohen by his side. I just feel like there's so much great, there's so much things we can do, like, Kodak, whose real name is Bill Capri, faced a judge Tuesday in an orange suit after turning himself in following an arrest warrant issued for violation of his pretrial release. Authorities said he tested positive for fentanyl during a random drug test earlier this month. What is this? I'm just and I write about this situation. Black addressing the judge after the pretrial release technician testified he may have mixed up the samples between Black and another patient. There's no way you tested positive. We can resolve that by way of a hair sample. And that, that'll clear you. Judge Barbara Duffy then asking for a hair sample today to clear up the alleged mix up, which Black refused, rather, choosing to check into the legacy rehabilitation facility for 30 days as part of his pretrial release. You better get it together. Black was initially arrested in July after state troopers pulled him over and found 31 oxycodone pills and nearly $75,000 in cash, in addition to Black driving with an expired license and tag. And Kodak Black is also known for making contributions to local charities. In fact, he is expected to perform at a Rolling Loud concert in California this upcoming weekend, where part of those proceeds will go to a charity that he supports. He will check in to that rehab facility the following Tuesday.